tricarboxylic acid cycle, also known as Krebs cycle. This cycle is the final pathway where the oxidative metabolism of carbohydrates, amino acids, and fatty acids converge. Their carbon skeletons are being converted to carbon dioxide. Two carbon acetyl coenzyme A joins with four carbon compounds to form six carbon compounds known as citric acid at the end of the cycle. And this oxidation provides energy for the production of the majority of adenosine triphosphate. The cycle occurs totally within the mitochondria and is in close proximity with the reactions of electron transport, which oxidize the reduced coenzymes produced by the cycle. The TCA cycle is an aerobic pathway because oxygen is required as the final electron acceptor. Reactions such as catabolism of some amino acids generate intermediates of the cycle and are therefore called anaplerotic reactions. The TCA cycle supplies intermediates from synthetic reactions such as cycle functions in the formation of glucose from carbon skeletons of some amino acids and it also provides building products for some synthesis of amino acids and the heme part. The TCA cycle is a traffic cycle which compounds entering and leaving as required and it's not a closed cycle. We are going to look at the reactions within the TCA cycle and enzymes controlling carbon removal are known as decarboxylases and the enzymes that control release of hydrogen are called dehydrogenases. In the TCA cycle, oxaloacetate is condensed with an acetyl group from acetyl coenzyme A then regenerated as the cycle is completed. Two carbons entering the cycle as acetyl coenzyme A are balanced by the two carbon dioxide molecules exiting the cycle. We start with the first reaction known as oxidative decarboxylation of pyruvate. Pyruvate is the end product of aerobic lycolysis, transported into the mitochondrion by a specific pyruvate transporter that helps pyruvate cross the inner mitochondrial membrane, then enters the this year cycle. Once in the matrix, pyruvate is converted to acetyl coenzyme A by the enzyme known as pyruvate dehydrogenase complex. This pyruvate dehydrogenase complex is not part of the TCA cycle, but is a major source of acetyl coenzyme A. The second step in the Krebs cycle is synthesis of citrate from acetyl coenzyme A and oxaloacetate. The condensation of acetyl CoA and oxaloacetate to form citrate, known as a tricarboxylic acid, is catalyzed by the citrate synthesis, and it is inhibited by its product citrate. Substrate availability is another means of regulating this citrate synthesis. Citrate being an intermediate in the tricarboxylic acid cycle, it provides a source of acetyl coenzyme A for cytosolic synthesis of fatty acids, and citrate also inhibits phosphofructokinase and activates acetyl coenzyme A carboxylase. We move to isomeration of the citrate which has been formed from synthesis of coenzyme A. Citrate is then isomerized to isocitrate by the enzyme known as aconitase. The third step is oxidation and decarboxylation of this isomerized isocitrate. Isocitrate dehydrogenase enzyme is responsible to catalyze the irreversible oxidative decarboxylation of isocitrate, yielding the first of the three NADH molecules produced by the tricarboxylic acid cycle and first release of carbon dioxide. This is one of the rate limiting steps in the tricarboxylic acid cycle. The enzyme is allosterically activated by ADP and calcium ions and inhibited by ATP and NADH whose levels are elevated when the cell has abundant energy stores. Another step is oxidative decarboxylation of alpha-ketoglutide. The conversion of alpha-ketoglutide to succinyl coenzyme A is catalyzed by alpha-ketoglutide dehydrogenase complex. The mechanism of this oxidative decarboxylation is very similar to that which is used in the conversion of pyruvate to acetyl coenzyme A by PDH complex. 
The reaction releases the second carbon dioxide molecule and produces the second NADH of the cycle. These coenzymes require one thiamine pyrophosphate, lipoic acid, FAD and NAD positive and coenzyme A. Cleavage of succinate coenzyme A. Succinate thiokinase or succinate coenzyme A synthase cleaves the high energy ester bond of succinate coenzyme A to form succinate. The generation of GTP by succinate thiokinase is another example of substrate level phosphorylation. Another step is then oxidation of this formed succinate to form fumarate and this is oxidized by the enzyme known as succinate dehydrogenase. Succinate dehydrogenase is the only enzyme of the TCA cycle that is embedded in the inner mitochondrial membrane. As such, its function as complex two of the electron transport. Another step is hydration of the form fumarate. Fumarate is a hydrated to malate in a freely reversible reaction that is catalyzed by fumarase enzyme. Malate is then oxidized to oxaloacetate by a process known as oxidation of this malate by the enzyme known as malate dehydrogenase and this reaction produces the third and the final NADH of the cycle. The energy that is produced by the TCA cycle. Two carbon atoms enter the cycle as acetyl coenzyme A and livers carbon dioxide molecules. The cycle does not involve the net consumption or production of oxaloacetate or of any other intermediates and four pairs of electrons are transferred during one turn of the cycle three pairs of electrons reducing 3 NAD to NADH and one pair reducing FAD to FADH2 oxidation of NADH by electron transport chain leads to formation of approximately 3 ATPs whereas oxidation of FADH2 yields approximately two ATP molecules. The TCA cycle is controlled by the regulation of several enzyme activities and the most important of these are those that catalyze reactions that are highly negative. Citrate synthase, isocitrate dehydrogenase, alpha ketoglutide dehydrogenase complex and reducing equivalents needed for oxidative phosphorylation are generated by pyruvate dehydrogenase complex and the TCA cycle and both processes are upregulated in response to a rise in ADP. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, like on the video and share to your friends. We are glad to receive your comments in the comment section below.